Hey guys, and welcome to the Bind View. Hope you guys are all doing well. In this particular video, we're going to be talking about Lucas Hernandez, various news surrounding when he'll be back, so on and so forth. Uh, and there is news um, today that there um, is positive talk going around a contract renew, a renew, renewal, I can't speak, either way, and um, that's what we're going to be talking about in this video, if you haven't checked out the video earlier that we did, uh, I put it up, I believe 11 o'clock UK time, um, on um, Victor Osimhen, check that video out, um, but yeah, we're going to be going, like I said, with Lucas Hernandez, and I'll have another video out for you guys tomorrow, and we'll go from there, and I've got something cool planned um, as well, so without further ado, let's get into this one, so the first thing that needs to be said, Lucas Hernandez or on his comeback uh it says uh and this is what he said he said i'm doing very well um uh, the injury is getting better and better i will be fit again for the champions league final um as obviously if we get to that which i think we have a very good chance of doing that but it obviously depends on who we get how we play so on and so forth uh according to build hernandez is right on schedule with his rehab um the injured knee is healing well um and has been stable so far so there isn't any actual knock um knockbacks from um you know the um injured knee that's healing um so yeah let me know what you guys think necessarily on that um to be honest i thought he was going to be up for the rest of the season and we'd have him back um you know august you know maybe after august time to be perfectly honest with you so um that's that's what i was feeling uh, and that's what i was thinking so um yeah there's that now where is the other um news um so yeah it's good good news that it's healing. That's obviously what we want to hear. He's one of our main players, of course. Um, we've been doing brilliantly well without him, but adding adding him's just gonna make the squad depth even better. Um and obviously he's he's a massive miss for France as well as obviously Bayern Munich. Um I'm just trying to find the other news. I've seen it here. It's here somewhere. Um, so, yeah, let me know what you guys think of that one. Oh, here it is. Uh, and then it says here, positive talks uh, took place with Bayern Munich and Lucas Hernandez's management. Uh, things um, could go uh, could now go quickly for the Frenchman to sign a brand new long-term deal at Bayern Munich. And remember, um, not so long ago, PSG were looking at him. Um, so it's very good. Um, I'm very happy to hear it. Um, I would like if he would... I know obviously it's not his fault, but if it, the injuries could, you know, do one would be perfect because we do need him fit. Um, but at the moment, Pavard, Upa and they, um, not they are, that I've already said they are, um, De Lit are doing fantastically. And obviously we're going with a back three now for some reason. Um, uh, so yeah, there's that. Let me know what you guys think. And then his agent on the contract talks with Bayern Munich. Uh, he said, there's nothing to announce so far. The most important thing uh, right now is that Lucas gets um, really healthy again, uh, which obviously... Uh, that's what we want to hear. He said, Lucas is just happy to be back on the pitch. Uh, the injury was uh, very bitter for him. Um, he's very happy now, um, which again, it's great to hear. That's what we want to hear. Uh, then um, last thing to say on this one, uh, it says Lucas Hernandez wants to be uh, make a comeback before the end of the season. Uh, the uh, DF, uh, DFB Pokal uh, final is June the 3rd and the Champions League final is the 10th of June. Um, so um, they are his targets to be back for, for those. So what? For him to be back, what at the start of um, start of June or, or just just before then uh, to get back for that final and obviously get to the uh, Champions League final if we get there, God willing, we get there and um, I, I hopefully we will get there this season. That's why I would, I would love nothing more than to win the Champions League again. Um, and that's his target. He said, meanwhile, Hansan wants to uh, wrap up a new deal for him uh, by this um, by the summer at the latest so basically what it's saying is lucas wants to be back for the two finals if we were to get to those and that's obviously the aim um and um hansan or brazo however you know him um he wants to wrap this this up quick um uh, that's generally you know it's good that's what i want to hear i don't want to hear that our director of football or whatever you want to call him um you know our, our transfer guy is messing around and not signing players you know um there was obviously rumours of Lewandowski leaving when obviously that all that debacle was going on 
um, and obviously we did end up selling him uh, and obviously we lost Alaba on a free so we don't want to be leaving anyone on a free and we don't really want to be losing someone of his calibre um, because they, he most definitely will go to a, a European rival if that's Barca, Real, PSG, Juve, so on and so forth he will go to one of the big clubs because he's absolutely brilliant so yeah that's basically that that's the update on his injury uh, he wants to be back around June time and um, his contract talk so yeah very looks looks on the positive uh, and only on the up to be perfectly honest for Lucas which is very very good and I'm happy to hear with that said though that's gonna be it for the video if you guys have enjoyed smash the thumbs up button hit the big red subscribe button down below thank you for 1.2k you guys are absolutely amazing we keep pushing we keep striving um you know hit 2k 3k and just keep pushing so yeah thank you so much for the support um and yeah that's gonna be it for the video till then though peace out guys